And welcome back folks, welcome back to Viewer Response. This week there was one question regarding my Sin playthrough. Todd L said, when I defeated Thrall, the ending cutscene wouldn't show up. Completed it earlier this night. Do you know why? Might it be because I saved when Thrall died? Okay, I'm going to assume here that you are referring to the pre-rendered ending cutscene and not the in-game cutscene at the end. The honest answer is, I don't know what causes this. I actually tried to reproduce your error, but unfortunately I do not have access to my computer right now. The most helpful thing I can say is probably this. When I was recording the ending of Sin, the game seemed to struggle a bit with loading the cutscene, in fact. I almost thought that the game had crashed. So I imagine that your difficulties are related to graphic settings. If you bought Sin from GOG, I would suggest to try a switch off Nglide. At least on my machine this helps some issues with graphical performance and stability. Unfortunately, Sin still contains some bugs. However, the version that you can download from GOG is probably the most bug-free version of Sin in history, but unfortunately it still is not completely free of hassles. In view of Ubisoft's recent disasters with Assassin's Creed Unity, there's much talk about unfinished games right now. But one has to bear in mind that the practice of releasing unfinished products has a long history in the gaming industry. And in this history, unfortunately, Sin plays a prominent role. In fact, when Sin shipped, it had so many bugs that calling it unfinished was only slightly unfair. In fact, the very first Penny Arcade comic was devoted to Sin and its extremely long loading times. Before I end this video, let me point out to you a link to a very interesting retrospective of Matthias Vorch and his work on Sin and how he got into the gaming industry in the first place. As you may remember, if you watched my last Sin video, Matthias Walsh was one of the level designers who worked on Sin. I will put a link in the description. Thanks for your comments, thanks for listening to this video, Merry Christmas and goodbye.